Guys, this is Morton Power 35 here, and today I have um, some really good news for you PC users for Black Ops 3. Um, back when the game launched, Treyarch um, said that there were going to be um, features on the PC version that would allow um, uh, modding, map progression, um, custom game modes, things like that. And then for months and months and months, we haven't heard anything. They said we'd have more information at the beginning. To middle of um, 2016 and we finally now have um, information on when we could start seeing either the alpha the beta for this um, these modding tools as they're calling it for the PC version Treyarch announced last week that um, they would be having a closed alpha for um, people in the modding community for the DC now what that means is they're just going to send out um, some invites to people that um, do modding for uh, the PC versions of um, games and they're going to have them test out the tools, see what they need to fix, bugs, um, like that, um, so that they can do it. A closed beta for people, I guess, who pre-ordered the game through the PC, through Steam, or, um, or an open beta for everybody on PC. Now, I don't personally own a gaming PC, but I am working on it. I really, really want to um, to get a gaming PC um, so that I can do this. Because this is really, really interesting. Because you can go, you can take and make your own DLC maps that you and your friends can play on that, that nobody else, you know, has. And that's the one thing that the PC has that the PlayStation 4 or the Xbox doesn't have is... You can, yes, PlayStation gets all the DLC first, all the DLC drops first. But when this, um, when these modding tools come out, you can create your own custom maps. Like give them your own, your own design. Give them your own flavor. Heck, they don't even have to be the three lane system that Treyarch does. But that's where they're giving it the creativity to the community. That's where they're giving the power to the community. And I feel like that's something that's been long overdue for the Call of Duty community. Um, that they should give power to the uh, the community because the community is what makes their game successful. Um, you know. But uh, yeah, let me guys know what you think. Um, how many of you guys are PC users for Black Ops 3? Um, and what would you like to see out of these modding tools? And I've also heard that you can um, make your own custom game modes. And I know there's a lot of people that like to do that with hide and seek because I do a lot of these mini games that I've I was inspired by um some other YouTubers, Twitch broadcasters, things like that to do um mini games like hide and seek, Michael Myers, things like that. You can make your own custom game modes like that so we could have an actual Michael Myers game mode in Black Ops 3 for the PC. Which would be fantastic. But yeah let me guys know what you think. Um if you guys really want to see this, if this is something you don't want to see, I'll go ahead and tell you right now, I'm super excited for this. This is making me want to go get a PC and um, and get to do this, um, you know, play, do these modding tools when they come out because they're going to start sending out the keys. They said last week when they when they announced the uh, closed alpha that they're going to be um, sending out the keys this weekend. Um, yeah, this week. Um, for for the uh, for the people that they've invited to do this closed alpha, which means maybe month, month and a half, two months, it probably could be sooner. We never know that we could have the open beta so or closed beta. Um, so that's just it's it's getting closer and closer and closer, and it's just inevitable. And I know I got to thinking because I I've, I've been hearing about when I first bought the game that I heard about the PC version being able to have modding tools. And then all of a sudden you don't hear anything and I'm like, okay, why are, why all of a sudden do we not hear anything about this? You know, um, but that they were, they've been working on it really hard, trying to get everything ready for this, um, for this closed alpha and they're, they're just diligently working to serve the Call of Duty community. Treyarch is doing a fantastic job with this game. I know they've been getting a lot of heat because of the, uh, the black market stuff, but 
that's a um, that's its own video for its own day. Um, I'm not really gonna get into that. Although I am not doing um, supply drops anymore, as in buying them. But, um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, let me know in the comment section um, if you guys want to see me do some uh, some Black Ops 3 modding. Um, and what what you would like to see, you guys can help me make these maps if I if I do get this PC. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, subscribe uh, to the channel to see my see more videos because I'll be doing some more videos over the next couple of days. Um, you know, just to just to keep you guys updated on things. Um, also subscribe or well, we don't have to subscribe, but like if you enjoyed this video, like if this video helped you with um, the update and. Uh, yeah, thank you guys.